everyone, I'm Vale from Mike and Vale's Life, and today I just want to share with you my D Disney, Dooney, and Burke collection. This is everything that I own except for the Magic Bands, because I want to do a separate video on those. So I'm just going to get started. Now the very first two things, and I know you're thinking, well that's not Disney, Dooney, and Burke, and you're right. These are from 2015. Me and Mike went to Disneyland and to Walt Disney World in the same year. So what we did is we bought the park backpacks and just bought them for souvenirs. And I just put them in between the shelves. But let me get started on what is Disney, Dooney, and Burt. All right, this one is the Adventures. I purchased that online. I do remember it was on sale, but I don't know how good a sale or anything like that, but it was on sale. I do love checking on Shop Disney to check out their sales. Now this was a food and wine festival purse from 2016, and I did buy that at the park. At Epcot. I just thought the, the colors are just so beautiful. Now this I, I think will be have to be my favorite. This like I said we went to Disneyland in 2015 because Disneyland was celebrating their 60th anniversary which is the same year I turned 60. So that's what I wanted to do for my birthday. And there's where I turned 60 was at Disneyland. So that purse really has a lot of meaning. Now, this is the Jungle Book, the tote and the little wristlet. And they are so pretty. I fell in love with these when I seen these. These, I got these from Shop Disney. Now all three of these are the Nutcracker. I got the tote. Let me move this. And then just the little purse. And then the double zip satchel. These came from Shop Disney and they were on a really good sale. Especially the tote bag because I was not going to get that and it went and it was such a good deal. I'm a deal junkie and I had to get it. Over here I have this is just the I think it was just called the Mickey Mouse collection. Um can't really remember, but it is real, real pretty. And Shop Disney is that on that one as well. Now this was one that I did buy at the uh, the Flower and Garden in Epcot. It was 2016, I think. I'm sorry. No, 2015. I'm sorry. Here we go. And this was one that I did sort of mess up on. You see the pattern. I think when it was hanging up, someone had turned it to this side. And all I seen was this right in a row. And I thought that was just so pretty. And I just wasn't paying attention about the, the little uh, Dooney and Burke logo. And not until I got home and it was too late. So... That was a really good lesson for me because that's the first thing I notice now when I'm buying in person. These three are the Nightmare Before Christmas, Shop Disney, and these were on sale. I got the backpack, the wallet, and then just the regular little satchel. This is mini had a little bistro. This is a tote bag and it is so pretty. And I bought that 
at Shop Disney as well. And as you will know, they, most of them are uh, just shop online because we don't get to go that often. I mean, we don't live close, so I, I just let my fingers do the walking and, or the shopping, rather. This, I'm really excited over this. This is the Haunted Mansion. It's the purple one. And Matthew and Michelle, our youngest son and his wife, gave me that for my birthday one year. And here is another Haunted Mansion. Shop Disney. And another Shop Disney. This was the 50th anniversary of the ride uh, at Disneyland. But I just thought it was so pretty I had to get it. Now this one, I had to get a personal shopper on this one because I could not, they never had it where you could buy it online that I ever found. And I wanted it so bad because it has 1955 on it. So I did get a personal shopper to, to buy me that one. And here is my Pixar Hobo Shop Disney. And this one is really, this one, like I said, I'm a deal junkie. It, they had it on Shop Disney. It was so cheap that I just had to get it. And I can't remember what the price was, but that's the reason I have that one. Now, this is the Star Wars run. One year, and I forgot what year it was, and I can't find it on the the uh, little tag. I thought it would show, but it, I, I couldn't find it. And that was the year that we all ran in the Star Wars race they had. They did a 5K, which me and Mike did, a 10K that Michelle did, and Mick and Matthew ran in the half marathon. So I had to get that purse. And this is another run. This was the Dopey Challenge in 2017 that Mick ran. He did, he actually did the Dopey Challenge that year. Now these three are all in the uh, sketch pattern. This was the very first purse that I bought. Let me move this for just a second. I bought it on Shop Disney, and I just thought it was so pretty. I love the zipper. Look at the zipper on how pretty that is. And then later, I did buy this size, and then the little makeup bag that was also given to me by Matthew and Michelle for my birthday. Now, 2020, we did go to the Food and Wine Festival again, and I did buy this one. This is a Shop Disney, and this, another, I call it a, a little bit of a mistake. If I had read the description better. I probably would not have bought this uh, wallet and purse because it is made out of uh, like a cotton material and I am scared to death of, of ruining it because I'm a very clumsy person and I'm afraid I'm going to spill something or whatever. So basically it just stays out just looking pretty. And it is. They're really, really pretty. Just I'm too scared to wear them or take them. Now, this is another one of those um, Disney Vacation Club purses and a little wristlet here. And I know you think, well, why are you buying that one? Because this one, I just thought was absolutely gorgeous. I love the colors. Look how pretty that is. Though I'm not a member... I just think it was just so pretty. 
And my last two is back to the Haunted Mansion. Because the Haunted Mansion is very special to me and Mike. Because we went on our honeymoon to the Haunted Mansion. Uh, to the Haunted Mansion, I'm sorry. We went on our honeymoon to Walt Disney World. And we rode the Haunted Mansion and we just loved it. And that is still a ride that we have to ride every time we go. And one time we actually waited an in line for an hour just to get on this ride. So the Haunted Mansion really is something special for us. That's all I have for you today. I hope everyone's enjoyed. I deeply appreciate each and every one of you for stopping by and letting me share this with you. I hope everybody has a great day and a wonderful week. Bye-bye! And may God bless.